Okay, so then we are to start to create a transparent image for the Crosshair tool that you can load in transparent Crosshair way. So first of all, you start and open a new project. You can choose any size. I would recommend to use the same size as the width and the height. So let's start with 250. You choose what you want. Okay, now I just fit the screen, select the mouse selecting tool, control A, and then you have this midpoint. I just take up here, if you don't have it, press control and R, and then you just take up here and take it to the middle here. So you get the midpoint of the project almost. Okay, then you create a new layer down here. You can now just drag and drop this into the trash cane. Okay, now you can choose any color you want here. And we just press so we get it almost in the middle. So now we have created it because we deleted the background and the layer, as you see, is these white gray dots or squares. This means it's transparent means you can see through it. So we can add another one and like add some blue around here. And if you drag it under here, this will come at top. Then you can take an opacity and take it lower. And maybe a little on the fill. Okay, now we don't see so much, but and then you can take on and save as and PNG. And then you just select the name of it, save, OK, open the tool, load PNG, choose the PNG you made that is transparent and just press start. As you can see now, it's transparent, you can see through it. And that's how you create in transparent and as you see, yes, the red dot ain't transparent means, well, it's hard to see through it, so we can easily fix that we are changing the transparent here as well. And you can just play around with your skills in Photoshop and have fun. So that's simply how you do it. And just to show and as you see now, you can see, you can see it, I hope. There, now you see it. Okay, so that was all.